Hello everyone and welcome to my new unboxing video where I show you everything I got in the past few months which is like four dresses, some accessories, some shoes and everything. It's all going to be here in my Brando bag so I hope you enjoy this video. This video will come out in 2021 so happy new year and I hope this year will be much better than the last one. So without further ado let's begin. Oh, and I already know what we'll begin with. So, I've recently ordered from Angelic Pretty Paris. Recently, there were many great MTOs and some great are coming up now in 2021, like Sugary Carnival. So, if you see this video and they're not out yet, hoard money, get them, because they're worth it. Okay, but uh, for me, I saw something that I didn't want and for some reason I got it and I don't regret it. So the MTO high-waisted dress from Melody Toys in mint. The MTO is made out of cotton, which is a big plus point because uh, cotton is much superior than polyester, in my humble opinion. Um, the dress has some beautiful details, like all those different uh, colored buttons. Yes, buttons is the way. So, and also, all of these bows are detachable. So, if I for some reason don't have enough hair, hair accessories for once, I can put these off, put them on a hair clip and um, put them on my head. So very versatile or I can just put them on other places, on other dresses. It also has a very unique cut in my opinion since normally uh, AP has some very regular uh, shoulder straps like this one, but in Melody Toy's case, uh, it has like those poofy uh, straps, which in my opinion can make some look a little out of shape. Uh, but Lolita is not really about looking sexy and super slim, so it looks cute like this in my opinion. It has a partial back shearing and corset lacing, as well as uh, it comes with waist ties with different colored buttons, which is a cute detail. So the biggest plus for this dress is definitely the print, which are so many of uh, AP's more famous uh, mascots. And also um, those little pony, I think it's Milky Pony. And this pony comes in bag shape and everyone is obsessing right now about them. I couldn't afford them for my life. But if you'll ever see me with one, you know I don't have uh, two kidneys anymore. I was so insecure about my body in this, but after wearing it for like two hours, I was obsessed. I love this print, I love this dress and I wanted some more mint in my wardrobe. Uh, this one is a lot darker and more vibrant than um, my other AP dresses in mint. so. It's definitely a great addition and of course I had to get the matching head bow since I don't have any mint accessories. It's a very small head bow in comparison to others but it has also a very unique shape. My unique, it's um, not as common for an AP head bow. So, so I'll put it away now and we'll have a look at everything else I've got. So. Stay tuned. Okay, so I'm always on the search for new OTKs, which is over the knee socks, if you don't know. And Angelic Pretty has many beautiful ones. And the past few months, I got like three pairs and I won't show them all to you separately. So you'll get to see them all 
now together so I don't have to bore you with all the socks I've got. So here are they. Um, those three pairs are all the socks I've got and I'll put them away now so we can continue with the main pieces for now. So for the next item I have to put a little disclaimer because I haven't bought this dress for myself. It was a present from my friend Millie. Uh, she started her own um, casual Lolita brand which is called Lollipop Lullaby and they make beautiful uh, casual and daily Lolita um, dresses for everyday wear as well as the cutest pajamas I have ever seen. Most of my friends immediately bought the pajamas and I've seen them worn and they are gorgeous. I have put here a picture for you and she sent me one of her beautiful dresses and I'm going to show you now one of her self-designed dresses which is so adorable. <laughs> okay, this is the Bobo Beer Day Gown by Lollipop Lullaby. came in I think three different sizes and she designed everything herself. Look at it. It has um, beautiful boba tea on it. I think we call it bubble tea here and it also has super cute beers. I love beers as well as bunnies of course and this print really speaks to me. I've worn it for a date with my boyfriend recently and he said I look super cute as always <laughs> it's very comfy very light and I think it's perfect for casual and daily lolita cords which I'm a big fan of especially when I can go to university again I think it's going to be one of my go-to dresses for occasions like this so if you're interested uh, in Millie's arts and crafts, go to her Instagram. She is um, an amazing artist who's doing a lot for charity. Uh, you can commission her and uh, most of the money or I think all of the money goes to charity, which is um, an amazing detail. If you want to get uh, a drawing of yourself or a Lolita drawing and you can also support charity, which is so cool of her. I'm, I'm always speechless when she's talking about her charity work. Um, or go to Lollipop Lullaby and um, get like the cutest pajamas ever or a daily Lolita gown or some of her uh, super funny t-shirts like the Choose Your Battle, uh, Battle Gear t-shirt. It's like super if you want to support any of this. So thank you Millie. I love the dress. It's gorgeous and beautiful and I'll put it away now and we're going back to me buying Brando. <laughs> so remember when I told you we're going back to brand? I was lying because recently I fell in love with something from Taobao. <sighs> so if you don't know what Taobao is, Taobao is like Amazon but in China and you can't really order it from here except you're using a shopping service or you're buying uh, items from there from a reseller here in the West. Normally I'm not a huge Taobao fan ooh, because uh, I lost my soul to old angelic pretty but when I saw this dress I was instantly struck because it looks sort of angelic pretty. It has the OTT spirit that I love 
and it was so cheap. So if you don't know, brand prices range from like secondhand 100 to 400, around that price range. And this dress came new with many accessories for like 50 bucks. So uh, you can tell it's a different price range, but it also varies a lot in quality. But for the price I paid, this dress is phenomenal. And it's one of the most detailed dresses I've got in quite a while. So here it comes. This is Rainbow Dollhouse from CC Cat, a Taobao brand. And this dress is gorgeous. Um, it feels a little cheap, but uh, not as cheap as some other Taobao dresses I felt. It has more details than I could have ever imagined. It came in two sizes, like in S and in L, I think. And one of my friends got large and it's, she said it's very roomy and I think the small size is also quite roomy but it's not a bad thing if you can breathe right <laughs> we had the chance to choose if we want round buttons in the front or heart-shaped buttons like we chose it has some kind of waist ties in the front as well as waist ties in the back the back has a uh, partial sharing but no corset lacing and it's very stretchy. Also, this dress has the longest shoulder straps I've ever seen. They continue 20 centimeters uh, longer than they should. And you have variant uh, size options where to put uh, your um, shoulder straps. I haven't seen Angelic Pretty do this in quite a while. Those are one of my favorite details, as well as all of the lace. I mean blue lace and pink lace and little beers on it as well as bunnies and of course uh, the print which is like an apartment complex full of beers and uh, bunnies and they're living their best pastel life which is everything I want to do in my life so another great thing about this dress. Um, it also came with a matching head bow, which you can form as you wish. So you can have it like this, or you can put it right here and maybe make it a little smaller as you like, or you can make it bigger, which is very versatile, um, especially since it does not have a print. So you can wear it with literally everything. The one thing I didn't like about the head bow is it came uh, with a little charm right here, which I uh, removed and put on a little uh, necklace. So now I have a little bee necklace, which is everything I need in my life. <laughs> they also released uh, matching rings for this dress, which I got the uh, bunny one from, but my friend uh, Minty Candy got the beer one and also the real matching necklace with this dress and not the fake improvised one I made um, as well as the dress in the mint colorway of course and we twinned it so I put you a picture right here I'll put my Taobao endeavor away now but I can definitely say I'll keep my eyes open for more releases like this because I lost my faith in many new uh, Angelic Pretty releases and it hurts my heart um, even saying it out loud, but Angelic Pretty has to get their shit together, right? <laughs> right? So, the last items in my uh, Brando bag are a full set uh, from Angelic Pretty and I got it in Germany and it is the Memorial Cake in white. I 
I already got Memorial Cake and the other Jay's Cake Cut in pink, but I like this print so much because my friend Minty Candy has it in, I think, also two cuts and colorways. So I got it in white in um, the lower waist Jay's Cake Cut uh, together with the matching socks and the head bow, which is uh, a little more grey than white, I think, but uh, I got it for a good price. So I already trimmed with her in this dress, but I don't think I have shown anyone the pictures. So here is uh, my memorial cake twin with uh, Menti Candy. And this is the last dress I've got today, so I'll put it away now. Oh, and the last thing I can show you is uh, my secret Santa present. Uh, my community did a little secret Santa with like six people who wanted to participate and I'm not a huge secret Santa fan because I'm very bad at making things myself and I'm always getting one person who is like the queen of self-made who can do everything much better than I could and I always get her and I always buy her Yaoi and something like this and I don't know, I'm, I'm a very bad secret Santa. But my secret Santa, which I will not name because I don't know if she wants to be named, got me this little headband, which is like a small bonnet. I've seen one of my friends wear it in black and it looked very cute. And I'll try to put it on now because I haven't really uh, tried it on in Lolita. Um, you'll see how it looks. Oh, I think it's very cute. Um, I always need something more comfortable for university and everything for more casual wear. So this is definitely one of my more comfy headdress, uh, headdresses. Can you see it? Uh, I think it's beautiful. Uh, thank you, Secret Center. And we'll continue now with nothing because the Brando bag is empty. So is my bank account and my motivations. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, follow me on Instagram, subscribe, leave a comment below uh, which item you like the most or what you want to see in my next video. I think I'm going to plan to uh, film a new wardrobe video, an update one year later because literally everything has changed in my wardrobe since then. So stay tuned for that, I think it's going to come up in two weeks, so uh, stay tuned. And I hope to see you next time. Bye!